Autumn 17 is the 100th anniversary of the Russian Revolution, a cataclysmic event with repercussions across Europe still happening today. So our season is a commemoration of that anniversary and we're presenting three central Russian works uh, as an investigation of Russian culture. Eugene Onyegin, Russia the Romantic, Kovanchina, Russia the Mystical, and From the House of the Dead, Russia in Chains, as it so often is. I think the audience can really expect uh, a music which is speaking about real stories, real life, through Mussorgsky and, and Janáček. They manage to bring a new language to the opera world. In our spring season, we are launching in 2018 our Verdi trilogy, which is a presentation of three of the late middle operas of Verdi. The Force of Destiny, La Forza del Destino, Ballo in Mascara, and Le Vepre Sicilienne. And in 2018, we will start with Forza, which is one of his most wide ranging, epic, complex pieces, a wonderful tapestry of personalities and music. Verdi is a composer that goes straight to the drama. You know, there are composers that uh, write for the music uh, and composers that use the music uh, to express the drama. And Verdi is one of these. La Forza del Destino is the only major Italian opera that I've not conducted. So I'm also very happy that I will do this, my debut with the company. Alongside Verdi, we have Don Giovanni and Tosca, two wonderful pieces. So there was a lot of pleasure to be had in our spring season. I think that it's a great idea for an orchestra which works mostly as an operatic orchestra to, to have uh, its own concert series because it shows another kind of dynamic in, in the ensemble which has uh, its own musical language, its own soul, its own sound. Well, I think the autumn of 17 offers three hugely substantial, serious Russian works. This is kind of serious opera, a, a big, robust meal. Uh, spring offers Italian flavor with Verdi. Verdi is central part of the popular repertoire of opera in Wales and in many other countries. <laughs> 